Hey guys, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter for basic Sorgonomics. I, I thought I called this a Twitter for a moment. That's okay. It's like I said, it's my podcast Monday of sorts. It's podcast morning. We're getting started and it's the weekly challenge. Please check out everything. I got uh, write ups and uh, a newsletter, so much more at Sorgatron.com to talk about social media, talk about video production. And I got a big, uh, a week from today, I actually got a big uh, presentation uh, down to Carnegie Library. We're talking about some social media video online, uh, Snapchat, for instance, uh, getting you guys on that. And that's a little bit of what I want to talk about today is trying out some of these new platforms. But first, uh, did you do the challenge? Did you do Did you do that one thing? Did you determine you want to be a writer? You want to be a broadcaster? You want to be a blogger? Did you Did you figure out that out and try to do it every day? It's not too late. Listen to last week's, last Tuesday's uh, weekly challenge and uh, see what we talked about there. So this week, it's try something new every day week. Um, so... I try to do this. I'm going to try to do this with Snapchat today and uh, try to pick a platform. Maybe I'll pick Vine. Maybe I'll pick something else. But, um, you know, kind of stretching your legs. Maybe you're somebody who's good at the Twitters. Maybe you're somebody who's really ingrained with that. You want to see if there's maybe new options out there for you. And this is kind of how I got into doing stuff like Snapchat. Says, well, I'm playing with this, you know, you know, and somebody say, oh, you're using that lately. I'm like, I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of wrapping my head around. I see what I can do with it. And uh, and that's kind of how when people are like, how do you keep up with all this stuff? Uh, I'm like, well, I'm always I'm always I'm always working with it. Right. I, I'm always trying to see what, what what's the app the kids are using. And uh, <laughs> I pull that around and, and I see what I can I can use it for. Now, I haven't figured out Snapchat for like promoting myself or anything like that. I think you have to be at a certain critical mass for that. It's more kind of entertaining fans, friends, you know, things like that. Uh, but uh, still, it's a pretty good outlet for creativity. And I've talked about Snapchat a, a good bit here on this show. Go ahead and search on uh, Sorgatron.com for Snapchat, and you'll find uh, a few discussions about that. But there's other stuff. Maybe you haven't tried out Meerkat. Maybe you haven't tried out Periscope. Maybe you haven't uh, dived into uh, Vine yet. Yeah, Vine something that escapes me as well, um, because I, I feel like I'm, I'm making videos for all these other things. You know, and when they make sense, I'll drop them on Vine. But I'm like not making anything for Vine in particular. And that may be part of the, my my issue is I'm I'm creating a wide breadth of content. For, across formats so i'm maybe not adapting things and making things directly for a platform uh, i mean as it is even the podcast that i do you know it started from these long audio podcasts and it turned into okay let's adapt them and put it on youtube okay now let's do these shorter versions and do them for youtube you know that's breaking that down and and, and kind of making something for the platform right you know something like this is going to be a shorter eh, 10 minute but still shorter video that you can pick up every day you, you know it'd be ridiculous to do an hour podcast i feel every day i don't think i have the audience for it i think i certainly don't have the audience for it as it is i talk to some of my colleagues and they seem a little overwhelmed about how much i'm putting out there but i don't expect everybody to listen to everything i i i i, I hope that people find their niche you know, talking about the tech, talking about the video games, talking about the wrestling, and and they kind of settled into it. And I want to give options for that for people to kind of dive into what we're doing around here in some aspect. You know, I can't imagine there can't be somebody out there that listens to everything I do, right? Right? Anyways, so yeah, for instance, I'm going to try uh, Snapchat today. Uh, maybe tomorrow, I'm going to try to make sure Vines are what's happening. You know, maybe uh, you know for for you, maybe you can say you know I want a Periscope day, I want a Meerkat day. You know, maybe it's just a you know do a day in a life if you if you have nothing interesting going on. If you have something, if you work at a company that you want to, or you're working for yourself, uh, I know a few friends that are that are uh, illustrators, and uh, you know, and I've talked with uh, one of them in the past about you know, hey, here's how you could use this to like you know watch you drawing and i've seen him putting some video on instagram lately you know just something to kind of convey a little bit behind the scenes and that's what a lot of this is good for if you do have something going on like for the podcasting i have people on periscope and meerkat they got to see me do <laughs> start a show without a mic hooked up for instance, because I forgot to hook it back up after the wrestling show this weekend where I have to take a little bit extra equipment out of the studio. And uh, there was a little behind the scenes. I got to have a chat with them about what's going on. I'm sure it was plenty, plenty captivating. And uh, and, and 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 they got to see that on Meerkat on, on Periscope because I kind of have a, a streaming array going on to the left of me over here. But uh, but this is how you stretch your legs. This is how you you expand out, you know? When you've heard of something, maybe you're, you're in the news, you know, watching your tech news or watching, watching uh, 
uh, Twitter and you see your friends pop, pop up on something new. You know, I mean, that's how you discover something like a Periscope, you know. And, and if you're somebody that wants to make sure you're getting on board early, I think it's worthwhile. Uh, it, 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 it keeps you, uh, that person ahead of the curve, you know, and then, uh, makes you look like the expert in the long run. Right. And, and that's what we're trying to do here is, uh, make you kind of the expert as well, you know, so maybe you don't have to come to somebody like me to try to figure this out. Right. And, and, and show that open-mindedness, you know, and, uh, and you never know what the next thing is going to be. Now we live in this world where, like, well, you know, it feels like a few years ago we were just like, well, Twitter, Facebook, that's it. You know, and there's all these apps kind of clamoring to be the next thing. Well, Instagram popped up and it was the next thing. Snapchat, Snapchat popped up and it was the next thing. And now we have this wide open field of all these things and the Pinterests Pinterest and and. You know, now you can do video on half these platforms that you couldn't uh, years ago. And now how do I take that? How do I take that video and adapt it for this audience? You know, we talked about 15 sec tech with Instagram a, a little bit ago here on this show. You know, they made something formatted for that. What do I do with Snapchat? I start formatting things for the limitations in there. Fine became so popular because people worked within the six second limitations of that application and the 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 light editing and of course it's, it's been expanded since but you know guys like rob on the run that worked on that and 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 created things six seconds at a time to the point where where he got sponsorships from i believe it was target and uh target and klondike and and disney parks for instance you know good for him yeah, he's, he's built that platform he's built his his identity on that platform and you never know what you could do too I have a few friends that they've wanted to, I think they've wanted to do some creative things. Um, and maybe they're not in the city that they can go, you know, to something like an open mic, you know, get get hands on with a lot of this stuff. But that's where something like Vine makes sense. You work at that. You can be anywhere, become a, become a Vine star, become a YouTube star, you know, or, or, or at least uh, spread your legs creatively. There was a, a guy on the YouTube documentary that he lived in the middle of nowhere and he's creating these videos and is just, you know, using Final Cut and After Effects. And, and, and that's what he's doing. You know, there's not much else to do. He doesn't have people to collaborate with a with a local comedy improv troupe or something like that if you were lucky enough to live inside the you know say in Pittsburgh or something like that you know it, it it's it's this is this is your your expanded audience at this point and you just got to figure out the tool for the job so so that's what I got for this week let me know uh what are you trying out you know say today I'm doing uh, say today I'm doing Snapchat follow Sorgatron on the Snapchat and maybe I'll remember to put that uh <laughs> Snapchat QR Cody thing on uh, on the site so you can follow me. And uh, oh wait, I can do that. Uh, no, I don't want to mess up with my Periscope. Uh, I saw Gary Vaynerchuk just throw it up on the video on uh, on his Ask Gary V the other day, and I wonder if that's something I could do. But no, we got a Periscoper in there, so uh, we're not going to uh, disrupt them. But uh, Sorgatron on Twitter, just look me up, just like the Twitter um, on Snapchat, and uh, we're going to have fun with that. We're going to have fun with that today and, and uh, keep an eye on Sorgatron on the Twitters and we'll see what I'm going to be playing with for the rest of the week. So let me know that and let me know uh, what else you're hitting up for last week's weekly thing, weekly challenge. Uh, sign up for the newsletter, everything else at Sorgatron.com. Subscribe to the YouTube, subscribe to us on iTunes, Spreaker, and Stitcher for basic Sorgonomics. And we'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.